hello guys now in the, our second part of the video about the solids determination so now our aim is to find out the volatile suspended solids and fixed suspended solids okay. so now i have done what i uh, i mean I just took the two samples because our furnace is a bit small so i have taken two samples here is the one which has a high amount of solids and this is my the second sample second water sample I will weigh this this is my crucible which can go till 750 degrees C so I'll put these filters and weigh it and then put in the muffle furnace the weight here is with the crucible is for the I mean you can say this is the first sample so this is 60.82 and we will be restricting to just finding out the volatile suspended solids which will, I mean it will be tedious to find out fixed solids because we have to I mean take it this out then uh, while taking taking this out there will be a loss so i will just be finding out the volatile suspended solids this one is 60.32 gram okay and we already know the difference between the volatile suspended solids and fixed suspended solids now this is my okay what i will do i have to set okay i'll set this time zero because i don't want any ramps and i don't want want any waiting time waiting time so i'll keep this at five and this is my so i'll just burn it for half an hour I kept the two samples here this is my first sample and this is my second sample after burning it will turn to ashes so it will be diff i mean difficult to i mean uh, distinguish so learn from i mean remember from okay and now let us close this and start so now it has started so it will directly go to 550 without waiting if i keep this i mean time so it will take suppose i'm keeping half an hour here to reach 550 so it will take half an hour to reach 550 and then it will run for 550 so this is the concept of time one and time two and already we know the difference between volatile suspended solid and fixed so volatile suspended solid is the organic portion in the solids and fixed is the inorganic you can see here this is the burnt part so it has turned out to ashes now what we will do we'll take this out and cool it and weigh it now the weight of the first one is 59.09 gram to significantly drop of the second one is 58.79 gram so here as per the calculation in the first case the volatile suspended solids are around 70,300 milligram per liter whereas in the second it is 50,300 milligrams per liter okay so this is the volatile suspended solids which is the organic portion if you want to find out you have to find the inorganic i mean in case of fixed or fixed suspended solids you have to find out the inorganic uh, solids in the water now in our uh, i mean third and fourth part we will see how to find out the uh, i mean the total solids volatile solids and fixed solids also how to find out uh, total dissolved solids volat volatile dissolved solids okay and the fixed is okay so don't forget to watch like and subscribe